Viacom CBS unveiling its newly rebranded streaming service. CBS All Access will become Paramount Plus starting early next year. Joining us now first on CNBC to talk about this and also the sale of CNET to Red Ventures is uh, Viacom CBS CEO Bob Backish. Bob, it's great to see you. Um, tell us about the rebranding of the streaming service and how you think it fits into this competitive landscape right now, uh, given that there seems to be so many streamers. Yeah, sure, Andrew. Great to be with you guys. You know, Paramount Plus, we're super excited about the brand. As you said, we'll relaunch CBS All Access early in 21 under that brand. And what this is, is really an exciting next chapter for one of the most storied brands in Hollywood. You look at Paramount over the last century, a history of innovation, a legacy of producing great content, Oscar winners, etc. It's a brand that's always brought people together to enjoy the entertainment experience. And importantly for Viacom CBS, it has near universal brand recognition. So that fits with our global footprint. Uh, we will rebrand CBS All Access in the US and at the same time, or roughly the same time, we'll launch Paramount Plus internationally starting in Australia, Latin America, and the Nordics, again, uh, early 21. And this will be a truly differentiated product. You know, we're, we're talking about it as live sports, breaking news, and a mountain of entertainment. Um, so really excited about what we have going on with Paramount Plus. Bob, uh, what's the pricing structure look like? And, and specifically, when you look at uh, the launch recently of Peacock, of course, uh, owned by the parent company of this network, Comcast, and the launch of HBO Max and then Disney Plus, what have the lessons of those uh, launches been for your company? Yeah, so I think there's a couple lessons there, um, and they're in no particular order. One is you do have to price the product right, and while we're now not announcing pricing today, it will be at a compelling price point. Two is ubiquitous distribution is very important. Um, we're very familiar with ubiquitous distribution given our television business. We work with pretty much everywhere at one. And if you look at the streaming assets we have in place today, whether it's CBS All Access, Showtime OTT or Pluto TV, the largest fast service in the country, um, they are distributed very broadly. And I think that is important. But at the end of the day, it's going to come down to content and the experience for the consumers. And that's where Paramount Plus will be truly differentiated. Again, live sports, breaking news, a mountain of entertainment. Live sports, we're talking about the NFL, the NCAA. We're talking about golf. Now we've added UEFA. On the news side, benefiting from CBS's news is legacy, uh, obviously, in that business. And then entertainment. Really, we call it a mountain of entertainment. It comes from globally renowned brands, whether it's Paramount, MTV, Nickelodeon, BET, Comedy Central, Smithsonian. Each of those brands will not only have a deep library, but will have significant original content slates. And today, we announced uh, three originals. We announced the offer, which is really a scripted story of The Godfather, uh, obviously a tremendous film franchise. We announced the, the next uh, life of Behind the Music, which is a iconic music series. We announced Lioness, uh, which is a series from Taylor Sheridan, who's behind Yellowstone. And those are joining Camp Coral, which we announced previously, which is SpongeBob, SpongeBob spinoff, which we're dropping on the back of the U.S exclusive premiere of the SpongeBob movie, Sponge on the Run. So franchises figure very prominently in Paramount Plus, and we have many more originals to come. We see this service as having very wide demographic appeal because of that, kids, millennials, adults, um, and, uh, and real depth uh, in key genres. So we, we, we look at a differentiated position, and, and we believe we've arrayed our assets and capabilities to make the most of it. 